If you browse through Google Earth right now to look at the aerial view of Kathmandu, all you will see is concrete jungle with empty rooftops. Every time a crisis unfolds, we tend to realize how fragile our food systems are. We see food being destroyed, crops rotting in the fields, and at the same time, the urban population experiences high inflation. Our food travels hundreds of kilometers before reaching our plates. We do not know how and where it is grown and the amount of chemical it contains. As a result, there is a high chance we are nutritionally compromised. Among all these pool of problems, we have brought you an innovation and it is this vertical tower. It fits in an area as small as 20 square feet or a corner of your balcony. Anybody with a quick guide can grow their food easily and three times faster than soil best method of farming. This tower uses 95% less water and is technologically driven soil less method of farming. Can you imagine it? This tower holds the potential to feed the city. With a lot of research, we have built and tested two prototypes so far. This is how excited we were to have finished the very first prototype. We are still working on the design, making changes to make it more accessible, user-friendly and perfect for the plants to grow. The core principle of our initiative is optimum utilization of resources for maximum production. We aim to build self-sufficient urban communities where anyone can grow their own food year-round using our innovation. People who do not choose to produce will be able to sustainably consume locally grown fresh and organic food. Our innovation has the scope of turning unutilized spaces like a balcony and rooftop into production spaces resulting in stronger local food systems. Additionally, this tower can play a substantial role in reduction of greenhouse gases emitted during food transport. We want children to know exactly how the food they eat grows. Hence, we have plans to collaborate with educational institutions in the future. Or the beneficiaries of our project shall be universities, agriculture knowledge centers, national societies, government and inter commercial enterprises, and basically everyone who say yes to fresh food. A well-determined human resource, finance, and raw materials is what we shall require to execute our project. Speaking today in front of you all would not have been possible without the constant hustle of our team, the goals that we have set for ourselves and definitely everything that the Solferino Academy has provided for. I am Pralisha Adhikari and I am Ashray Dawadi. We represent Nepal Red Cross Society and, and together, together we are, are limitless. limitless. Namaste. Namaste.